A unique mission requires a unique airplane. The AC-130 Spectre gunship, assigned to Air Force Special Operations Command, provides close air support, air interdiction, and armed reconnaissance. To be used effectively, airmen must be trained to call in air support from the ground. One of the most effective training tools is with simulation. Captain Nicholas Mullet, a 19th SOS AC-130 instructor and navigator, came from Hurlburt Field, Florida to train airmen with the assistance of the flight simulator. He says the simulator is a vital part of the training. The primary goal of this simulator is to work on the verbology and get these guys experience with that uh, terminology that they need to uh, accurately and timely get fires on target from the gunship. A1C Kristen Peck of the 8th Security Forces Squadron says this is one of the best training opportunities she has had since arriving in Korea. And I actually learned a lot. I thought it was actually interesting to learn how to talk to actually one of the pilots and over the radio and also practice how to engage the target. The 8th Fighter Wing Commander, Colonel Brian Bearden, also believes the simulator is a great opportunity. It allows us to, you know, educate our uh, security forces and those who would, would be performing emergency casts, educate them on, on a capability that we haven't seen on the peninsula in some time. The AC-130 is a powerful weapon and has been a proven workhorse for over 30 years. With the training airmen receive, you can be assured that the fire raining from above will be on target. I'm Air Force Sergeant Aaron Drobnak, Kunsan Air Base, Korea.